John Bennett with Logic Pro X and in this video I'm going to show you how to do finger drumming with the iPad companion app called I'm I'm sorry the Logic companion app called Logic Remote which is completely ridiculous it's it's amazing you're going to love this so let's check it out I got my iPad on the screen here and I've got the app it's the Logic Remote just pop it open and you pair it there you go so the first thing I'm going to do is option command in. I'm going to do a software instrument. And in future videos, I'm going to show you some other ridiculous things you can do with these instruments. But for now, let's just pick a random one here. And you can see on the iPad that I have, I'll move it over here so you can see, all these pads on the iPad. Okay, I'm a terrible finger drummer, but I'm going to show you some ways to get around that. So first thing you want to do, I'm going to solo this track and let's get into it here. And what I'm going to do is just record. I'm going to just lay, I'm going to lay down my kicks first. I don't know, for me, it just makes sense to lay down the pieces as you go and then mess around with it. So here we go. Okay, that was awful, horrible. <laughs> but uh, let me show you how you can fix that. Double click it, opens up this panel here. I'm gonna shrink this so you can see more of the screen. And then I'm going to select all these functions, quantize notes, or you can use the Q and before I do that, you can see quantize is to the 16th note. You can change that. Like if you know you want it to be on a corner note or an eighth note, probably eighth note is what I'm going to go for. And I'm going to do functions, quantize. And now if you look, all these guys land on a note. So let's take a listen. Okay, so you get the idea. Now, if the note isn't the way you want it, you can simply drag it. So you got basically just on the beat kind of thing going here. Let's loop this region here. So you see how I've done that. Now, I mean, you can do all the same operations. You can, uh, you know, copy this option and drag to make a new one and do that. So that's just my kick. I want to play with this. So I'm going to get rid of this. I'm going to Like a, like a little, little fill here. I'm gonna get like really. All right, so let's take a listen. Like that, what I did just did, I'm gonna undo that. Okay, so that's cool, right? So now let's go in and let's um, lay down like a snare or something over top of it. Okay, and while you're doing this, you may want to have this, this um, metronome on so you can hear a click beat. So, totally up to you. 
So here we go. Let me just check which which snare I want here. I like that one. That's really awful. That's really, really bad. So like, what doesn't matter though, because I can just move these snares where I want them. So that's what we're gonna do. Like I, I didn't have a beat in my head and I'm kind of tired actually as I'm making this video. So I'm gonna just put these. get rid of these i'm just putting the um the snares on the two on the, the even beats here just a really basic beat to give you an idea of what you can do you can make them longer too that's cool Right, so we got. So, you know, you might want to drop that kick out from underneath the snare. So you go back in. Get some more, more room here and I'm gonna show you just can get rid of these kicks they're underneath the snare let me get rid of this snare The beat shaping up. So I'm actually gonna take this guy. So I'm gonna make it a little bigger. Make that guy a little bigger. Very basic beat, but you get the idea. You can keep layering it with more and more. And of course you can use the built-in drummer, but that's for a different video. And sometimes I really like the control of creating your own beats. Now let's go back and just get give you a flavor of everything you can do here. If I go back, show the library again, just gonna give you a feel. These are just different drum machines and you can see on the iPad, it matches the boutique matches here. So this is the kick. Epic Electro. Ooh, I like that kick. Low down dub. I mean, this is crazy. The note. I think this modern club is cool. Oh yeah, that's a nice one. Anyway, I'm really not a good finger drummer, but you get the idea and you don't have to be good because you just get the main idea and you just drag your stuff around. So that's finger drumming 
with Logic Pro X. Hope you enjoyed. See you on the next video.